Okay, we got the opening bell coming this way on Wall Street, um, and uh, ret retail sales coming in hot this morning. Um, I was, I'm still reeling from that 17 and a half percent increase in mm -hmm. department store it sales. It shook me. I'm shook. Are you shook? I'm shook. Shook it. I'm the shook. Department store I'm sales. Shook. Did you do any department store shopping in, in January, Seth? Uh, Did you add to that total? I, I know you added to I the bought, food and drinking place. Yeah, I bought a new. Total. I bought a new vest month for myself, but it was not on a sale. Vest? I bought a new vest. We'll take it offline. I don't want to promote the brand here, but it's very nice. I'm very excited about it. Yeah. Like a like a like a Patagonia kind of, style yeah, vest. Yeah, it's like more of an upper end type of vest. Very like a bro, vest. Very tech bro vest. Very Miles Alinda, uh, of course, our news uh, head can, of news here. Can you tell us wh at what store you purchased? Uh, Blooming, it? Bloomingdale's. Okay, Bloomingdale's. I was going to say if you were going high end, you yeah, weren't. You weren't going to Kohl's or Macy's. No, I'm but it's a true investment piece. You know, I didn't get it on sale, and, <laughs> and I was okay with the price. Piece. I was okay with this. Uh, I'm not okay with this market open here, guys. <laughs> you know, we're seeing the market really uh, take a dive off of those uh, that better than expected retail sales report. Maybe under the notion that the Fed's going to have to stay a little bit longer with interest rates. Uh, but Brad, not a not a great way to start the day. Yeah.